Johnny Ramon on 44. Yeah, it's cool. It's cool to have a punk um, guitar player here on this list because um, punk players getting often overlooked. Um, and there are good punk guitarists and Johnny Ramon is very fast and um, uh, very good playing and it's not not that that sloppy playing sloppy playing he is a great great he was a great guitar player and yeah cool to see him here and what's sad about this is um, that I hadn't the opportunity to see the Ramones live but um, I wish I could but um, yeah the music is, is still here and so listen to the Ramones and you uh, honor them and listen to the music. Johnny Greenwood and Ed O'Brien, yeah. Johnny Greenwood is, is, is the perfect fit for Radiohead. Um, he's he's like the Edge, he's creating such cool sound with sounds with his guitar using different effect pedals and um, his songwriting is very unique. And now he is um, making soundtracks for um, for motion pictures and um, he was twice nominated for an Oscar and um, yeah he, he also deserved being on this list because he is um, very very um, he, he's, a, he's a very good songwriter and he is um, a creator of, of, of such a uh, such a great carpet of sounds I call it uh, because he is uh, Radiohead um, would be not Radiohead without Johnny Greenwood. And Ed O'Brien, yeah, sometimes it feels like he is in the shadow of um, Johnny Greenwood, but he's his, Ed O'Brien has also his unique style of playing the guitar and um, both are, both need each other. And um, when you see Radiohead live, you, you see that um, they are both great musicians. And um, it's cool to have them here on, on this list. Vernon Reed. Um, Days ago, I saw a live um, video um, with um, Living Color, and they played um, Cult of Personality. I was, I think, it was in two thousand and twenty-two, and they sound the same, like in the nineties. The frontman, wow, his his voice is is maybe getting better with age, and. Um, and Vernon Reed is a, is a is a monster on, on 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 guitar. He plays this heavy metal funk um, stuff, and um, sometimes you hear it and you think it's sounding wrong. But um, he's so fast; you can't hear so fast when he is playing. Uh, it's it's very very cool guitar player, and maybe he is. Maybe he deserves a, a better place on this list because he is very underrated and um, his solo style and his rhythm style are very, very cool. And I think the Red of Chili Peppers um, were not the Red of Chili Peppers without um, Living Color. They both came to the same um, time, they'd be famous, but I think um, Living Color are the, the base for modern crossover heavy metal, hip hop, R&B stuff, and um, yeah, Venom Reed is a great, great guitar player. Bo Diddley, the, uh, the, um, the blues master, Chicago blues master, uh, 41, it's, it's, it's a good number, maybe a little bit too, too low in the list, um, he deserves a better place too, um, but um, he died in 2008, yes, and um, it's so, chilling music listen to Bo, uh, Bo Diddley and um, have them laying in, laying in bed or on your couch and turn the lights off and listen to the, to the music of Bo Diddley it's, it's great and um, it's always an adventure <laughs> well, place 40 place 40 John Fahey quite frankly I don't know him sorry guys 